Old folks home, I'll still hear that music in my head. Oh, <laughs> I was thinking all excited. I think I will too. I got all excited. I'll be jumping up and down going, oh, must be today's special value. Uh, hey, everybody. Here we go. Get ready, get set. We're now down to two. And then there were two sizes left of our today's special value. Still have three ship dates in what is the prime rib of the year. Kansas City State Company celebrating 90, 9 0, 90 years in the biz. Yeah. Uh, and it's been 12 years since we brought you the king. The prime rib is at today's special value. Good news is two of the sizes are still here. We started with three. Mm -hmm. And we're mixing it up in this presentation a little bit yeah. because Ralph Pellerino is joining us. And Ralph, I want to, this is a great choice here. Sure. Let's put them side by side okay. to help you mm -hmm. make a choice because we can verbally say the pound story. Right. And this maybe give you an indication of how many it will feed. Well, but just the, the visualization is going to help. Okay. It starts you got with a three and a half to four pounds. Okay, that's right here. That's right here. Serves six to eight people. There you go. Second choice, right next to it, Okay, is going to be the four and a half to five pound, and this is going to serve, this is going to serve eight to ten people. Look at that. This guy serves eight to ten. Mm -hmm. So that's how you make your choice. I like right? that. Now this guy right here, the four and a half to five, starting to get limited. Here's why I want to I, I show you right off the top why that's important. Because it's not that much more prezi payment to step up to this guy. If you want to do that, now's the time. Four, like a few dollars more prezi payment, four dollars more prezi payment, and you get, boom, massive, massive cut of meat that you'll love. Ship dates, nothing now. There's October, beginning of November, beginning of December. Sent to your door, frozen, easiest cut of meat maybe you will ever, ever have. That's right. And, which is really ironic because a lot of people, <laughs> Ralph, are intimidated by oh a prime rib. Yeah, they think there's like, oh, I'm going to screw this up. I don't want to screw up. Guess what? If you have an oven, a meat thermometer, a freezer, refrigerator, that's all you need. It's, that's all you need. Just all you need. Just now, defrost. Because this price is, is what it is, and we, we did the math earlier, we, no, no um, choice that you made is going to be like over $12 and change per half pound slice. Like serving... A lot of people, 10 people, half pound slices. That Those are big, major cuts of meat. People are taking advantage of auto delivery. Oh, I like so that, that auto delivery is you lock into that price, you're okay. charged when it's when it's shipped to you, uh -huh. and then the next one's going to be March, which is going to be 2024, right. and then holiday 2024. But you're ready from Kansas City. Right. Again. So, so my question is, what if I'm cooking the prime rib, not at my house, but somewhere else? Right. I'm going to someone else's house. I can get the prime rib shipped to where I'm going. I could get it shipped if you want to. Want to get an auto delivery. Okay. You can change the size if you want to. You're in total control oh, wow. okay. when it comes to uh, whatever choice you make. Those are choices. Yes. Let's get to the prime rib. Okay. So why is a prime rib so special? You know why? Because it's the most heavily marbled piece of meat on the cattle. It's fat forward. So when we say fat forward, fat equals flavor. What happens with this particular roast, it's a self-basting roast. You can't say that about any other roast because of the marbling. So in that eye right here, as it's cooking, it's breaking down. The fat breaks down that meat, makes it sweet, tender, and ready to go. I want to say that to you, and I listen to what you're saying, okay. and also reiterate, it's not all fat. It's not a fatty prime rib. You know, I've seen prime ribs where, whoa, oh, like you got to take the prime rib. You're you got to find the prime. Okay, here yeah, you you're not, you're not, You shouldn't be on a, on, a, on a journey to find the prime when it comes to a prime rib, especially here if you're is. buying a five pound and one pound of it is all fat. All right, so look at this. This is the roast, raw. Yeah. Okay, this is how it comes. We actually use a shaving machine to shave that fat down because, see this fat? you got to leave a little bit so you so get the So with that four crust. and a half to five, that's all prime rib. That's all prime rib. This is what it looks like. There's no bones no, about we it. We didn't trim this. See, you got the still. We didn't do anything to this. Defrosted, ready to go. Great. By the yeah. way, okay. This is second to last airing for 2023 mm -hmm. <laughs> on this guy. There's one more, a very short airing coming up with my, my buddy Rachel that I just ran into coming up later as they wind up our Christmas in July 2023 extravaganza, uh, and then that's it. So if you want to go for it, October, November, December, two choices remaining: three and a half to four pound serves six to eight, four and a half to five pound serves eight to ten. Easy choice to make, mm -hmm. right? An easy choice to make it once you get it. Let's okay. get it through. Let's go through that. Let's go. What do I got here? Okay, frozen. That's how it arrives on dry ice. You put this in the refrigerator. Three days, let it defrost. Ready to go the, ne the day of the special event. Take it out, put it on a baking sheet. Let so it you don't even take it out of the box. No. You just put it in the fridge no. and let that baby thaw out. I threw it in the fridge. Got it? Okay. Throw it in the fridge. Throw it in the fridge. The day of, let it sit out on a baking sheet just like this. Let it come up to room temperature. 
See that netting? The netting ensures even cooking. The netting is not to keep this together. So this you don't have to soak it in water. You don't have to do anything like no, that. No, no, no. Nothing, nothing at all. You just let it sit there. Can you imagine? So I let it sit to get to room temperature about two or three hours. You know what you could do in two or three hours? Okay, now. Everything else. All right, done. Now, you ready? You take 375. Can you put the oven on 375? Easy, right? Got it. In the oven it goes. Nothing special. Walk away. Hour and a half later, you get your meat thermometer out, right? You go in, you put it in the middle. When it reads about 125, 128. All the instructions are there, right every there. single step. You take it out, you put some tin foil on it, and then let it chill out for about 30 minutes. Game day ready. And then you wrap it in that tin foil. That's right. All the, what happens, what, what's the process there? It so doesn't get cold. It's called resting. So it's gonna go up 10, <laughs> it's gonna go actually up, it's gonna continue to cook about hmm. 10 degrees. So now, what I love about this particular item is that I can plan my dinner perfectly. If I tell everyone to be here at 6, we're sitting down for dinner at 6.30, what does that mean? That means I take it out at 6 o'clock, right, right, I right. tinfoil it, and at 6.30, everyone's sitting down having a glass of wine, and... Dinner served. Dinner served. You got dinner? Dinner served. What, what, Boom. Here we go. And now, I got over here. Okay. here we go. Yeah. And you get it ready. You can slice it as is. You can slice and serve it if you want to. Or uh, come over here, and everybody gets their half pound. Half pound. Yeah, so half we pound. talk about eight to ten servings. Ten servings. We talk eight pound, uh, I mean, everybody half pound servings. That's why our friend Meredith from Florida is back for more. Hello, Ooh. Meredith. How are you? Hi, Rick. Hi, Ralph. I'm Hi. fine. How are you? We're, we're doing great. Awesome. We're, we're really proud. <laughs> it's been... Yeah, 24 hours together? Yeah, 24 hours <laughs> together, but it's been 12 years since uh, the Kansas City State Company brought prime rib as a value of the day, so are you a fan? Yes, I am. I've had it before, and it's been great. Oh, wow. Easy? How about, is it easy? Very easy. Uh, Ralph, you've been excellent on telling how to do it. Great. Step by step, everything is right on cue. You did great. Oh, um, thank where, you, where, When are you serving this, Meredith, from Florida? We got to know. Give us, paint us a picture of how you're doing I bought it all three ship dates. Whoa. The five and a half to six on auto delivery. Whoa. <laughs> so you got all three ship dates? So you're going to do October and November and December? Yes, on auto delivery each one. Well, who are you cooking the five for? five and a half. Who are you cooking for her here? <laughs> about, probably about eight, eight to ten people. That's so we're so, good. That's so great. So great. Why would you invest and trust the Kansas City State Company to do it? You invested in a lot of great beef here. Why QVC and the Kansas City State Company, Meredith? The quality of the meat is superb. It's great. Yeah. That's the about ease of cooking is the best. Really? And Full the proof. price? is excellent you cannot find the price you guys are really doing well with the price have you oh. done that have you done that like shopped around for like a real prime rib like like we yes. talked we talked uh, like the big guy earlier somebody quoted 199 dollars out there price of beef is outrageous so we it nailed is. the price on this one that's so great you sure did that's Thank so great you so much three ship dates and auto delivery Where's the beef? Yes. It's at Meredith's house. That's where the beef is. <laughs> <It sounds laughs> thank, thank you, Meredith from Florida. We appreciate you. We love you. Uh, bye, thank Meredith. you. You take care and happy holidays. Bye-bye. Oh, you too. Okay. What did she say? The quality of beef is, is there. Right. It's foolproof when it comes to making it. Easy. She got three ship dates, man. Wow. Uh, that right? Yeah. And getting it and getting her size. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to name it, and okay. then you tell me again who might want the three and a half to four pounds. Got it. Go for it. Yeah? yeah, three and a half to four pound could be six to eight people. Or yeah. uh, if you want to stretch it, because these are eight ounce pieces, I don't know, maybe go to 12. You can go to 12 on that easy. Go to 12 on that easy. Easy. Just a little bit swollen, right? Especially if you got a turkey yeah. or a ham. A lot mm -hmm. of people do that. A ham, like we haven't been talking about that. Like the ham, you could do that as well. Yeah, can, yeah. Really stretch this out. Okay. And then here comes what is our big guy now, yeah. right? So, this is the sweet spot all day. Normally, this is the size that we offer. It is four and a half to five pounds, serves eight to 10 Eight people. to 10, right, at eight ounce portion. So again, you could stretch this one out probably to 14, 16, I don't know. Because huh. if you have turkey and prime rib, me and you talked about this, prime rib is so rich, it's so decadent. It's filling. It's filling, right? Mm. You can only have so much. <laughs> you, <laughs> you, you don't leave the dinner and then go get a pizza. No. Right, like you're like, no, like right. it's just like a little, little, yeah. Top us, yeah. you know, like you have oh little little bits here, and then let's go get a pizza. No, you feel like you've had a meal yes. after you've had prime rib. Yeah. So this is an opportunity for you to do it. The ship baits are here, but the price doesn't go away at the end of the day. Right. We've got now the smaller one. Yeah, okay. which is still big. Let's give some love to this one. And let, before you even cut, okay, take me on a tour. Well, three sixty. Okay. So first of all, what do we see here? 
You see that crust? Again, we didn't sear this. We didn't rub it with butter. All we simply did was put it in the oven. And because of just enough fat that mm. renders down, you get that meat candy. And then look at, by the way, this is just, I mean, this pops, right? And then just like at that carving station, at that black tie event, you mm. go ahead in your own kitchen or at the table side, I love table side, and you just carve away with a nice sharp knife, right? Let the knife do the work and look at this. And now- Every one of these has been perfect. They Every have, one of them yeah. is uniquely perfect. Guess what? 33,000 ordered. If you want, like Mary, a lot of people picked up auto delivery. If you want the November ship date in the four and a half to five pound, guess what? Last call, a few hundred remaining out of 33,000. So go for it. People are making their decision. You looked at it, you Googled, you frugaled it. Maybe you went to the grocery store. Maybe you said, wait a minute, how much per serving? $12 per serving for a half pound? Are you kidding me? That's what we're offering today. There's a catch. It goes away at the end of the day. That's right. Can we, sh we but you, <laughs> you tell me. We've been together way too long. No, man. it's all right. <laughs> uh, I love this eggs Benedict. I just, I love, love, love it. I'm sorry. I think it's a stretch. I think it's a really creative, fantastic idea. I like but that it. next morning. That's pretty cool. It is pretty cool because yeah. again, if you get that, you know, maybe the bigger size, you don't need much prime rib for eggs Benedict. I mean, man, come on. Prime rib. That that next morning, that uh, uh, the sandwich that we had with the au jus and the Swiss cheese, Ooh, that was sliced good. up the next yeah. morning. It's good, good eating, and your opportunity to pick it yeah. up right here and right now. Which one do you have? You got? Have you got the? This uh, is the uh, medium. This is the medium. Yeah, four and a half to five. This right. is the largest one we're offering right now. Right now, right. November ship date. A couple hundred remaining. Uh -huh. You let it rest, and then I love what you told you said earlier. Oh, um, how, uh, how in the back? Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna let's cut right into it to show you. This should be medium rare. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Okay. I mean, why is this happening? We're live television. This is not an infomercial. No. They're all perfectly medium, medium rare. rare. Why? Because you followed the instructions. You followed the instructions, yeah. You didn't do anything. There's Steve, no... our, our, our prep chefs, yeah. they were here all day. They followed the instructions. You know how many cooks at a time? Guess what? How many cook? 65. He cooked, he cooked he 60, 65. So listen to that, everybody. 65, 65 of these all day long okay. at midnight, in the morning, in the kitchen with David, four hours, and they all look like this. And when you let it rest, so when I, when I don't touch it, you're looking at it going, oh, okay, that looks okay. It doesn't look juicy. But you know why? When you let it rest, the juices go back into the meat and hide there. So when I rub that knife, wow. there it is. And by the way, so Rick wants me to show you something. So this is medium rare. If someone says to you, hey, Rick, I want a medium piece of that prime rib, do uh -huh. you have any handy? You go, actually, I do. You just go right in the back here, and now you start kind of making that person feel super special that you have them covered yeah. at medium. Just you like know, that. You know, that's great. That's the interior. Although, you know what the jam is? What's that? Is that crust. Yeah. Take me out. You know what? Turn, turn that baby around again. Yeah, sure. Show me that. What, 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 let me get a piece of that crust right there. Tell me the, the, the different parts of that. You were describing that earlier. Oh, sure. So this is the eye. Okay. Uh -huh. This the is eye. the eye of the roast. The eye. This is where that buttery richness kind of super tender is. I didn't know that. You didn't know that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then on this side, you have what's called the deckle, right? That is where that super intense kind of beefiness is. Mm. And that almost protects the eye of the prime rib. Oh. So you have two protectors. You have that layer of fat on top. And then you have that deckle. Do they ever just sell like a, like a restaurant, like just the deckle? Like you just you order yes. the, like I, you can order the deckle? Yeah, actually, I actually know that. It's like $65 for like a six ounce piece. <laughs> is that right? I swear to God, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's the way it 65. is. $65. Yeah. I'll take the deckle. But because, like when we talk about prime ribbing, like oh, just super deckle, intense please. and rich, the deckle, you can only have so much mm. of it. Okay. Okay. By the way, take a, put a white tablecloth on your kitchen table, Ooh. have some uh, advent calendar red wine, right? And mm. boom. And now you got your white tablecloth Russian. By the way, let's show a little footage here. This is the Kansas City State Company. Mm -hmm. This has been around, well, my, my, my friend Alan and I, he's our producer, yeah. we've both been around. We were here in 1995 when we visited Kansas City. Let's go back okay. to this extraordinary company. It's been around 90 years. Yeah, so we started in 1932 in the heart of all those stockyards, right? So we had access to some of this unbelievable meat, as you see right there. Now, what we did was we had this little butcher shop. People would come in and they go, wow, your steaks are really good. Because all we cared about was taste, taste, taste. Still, it's not actually on our boxes. And then word caught fire. And people said, I want this in my restaurant. Now, you as the consumer get to enjoy this restaurant experience. And that's right. how it started. Anybody, and, and, and I've done it, you've done it, we've all done it, many of us have done it. You go to that white tablecloth restaurant right. where they bring the beef over, they roll it over, and the guy's got the long aprons in there, yeah. right? You're paying through the nose and family style. Here comes the asparagus, here comes the hash browns. 
you better have a perfect steak, right? Because you're paying top dollar. You're paying so top it, dollar, yeah. 